Oh my god, guys. I'm laughing so hard. Aftermath. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh my god. If you don't know what it is, it's basically a free version of DayZ. Except, and, and hear me out, hear me out, shittier. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you hear about this? Did you hear about this? A zombie game worse than DayZ. I know, I know. I didn't think it was possible either. I did not think it was possible, but oh my god. They did it. Between horrible optimization, <clears throat> Daisy, but this is even worse. Um, horrible gameplay, but this is even worse. Um, it's pretty bad, but now the world doesn't have to deal with this game anymore. Because they stopped developing it. I just clicked on the game. And then I saw this. I was like, I wonder how that game's doing. And I the la I was I was looking at it, and I was like, uh, when was the last update? Because they like released four updates in their entire existence. As you can see, mm, the reviews aren't too hot, but it had decent graphics, so I I got it like a year ago. And I played it, as you can see, four hours. So, I wanted to see, that's just nothing, so I ignored that. And so then I clicked on this, because it looked like uh, a development thing. Nope! Haha! <laughs> oh my god. I cannot believe, the world has been rid, rid, ridden of this poison. Yes, yeah, so it's basically Daisy, except shittier. Didn't think it was possible. Basically, they stopped because they're too poor and their game sucks dick. Literally the opposite of DayZ. DayZ's like, hey guys, we took all of your money and um, we're going to take one month or more to put out a single update, which fixes nothing. So, you're welcome, and we're going to add shit instead of fixing it. You're welcome. If you guys know who Jamjar is, um, he's a DayZ YouTuber and streamer. He's fantastic. He makes beautiful, 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 beautiful videos. I mean, movie quality fucking videos. Please go check him out. He's fantastic. Even if you don't play DayZ, go check him out. He's Tajamjar, T-E-H, and he's fantastic. But he started making this term, uh, hashtag make DayZ great again. And it's not related to Trump at all, but um, he, he's, he keeps saying that hackers are the reason why DayZ sucks at developing. Ooh, I know he has like 3,000 hours on DayZ, and I kind of don't want to fuck with that. I have like 100, but really, dude, that's not it. Some, de believe it or not, some developers just suck dick, and that's the end of it. They, I mean, they just blow, and that's the end of it. They're lazy fucks. Some developers are, okay? H honestly. Dean Hall on d VR development, there's no money in it. That's the guy who's leading the Daisy development. Honestly, let's look up a picture of this guy. I think I've seen him before. Not in person. Check this out. Look at my broken game. Mm. Oh, look at me. I'm taking a vacation going everywhere. I have a broken game. Please buy it. Aftermath. Glad it's gone. Not a great game. Worse than DayZ. But it was free. And you know what I find funny? That they... I love how they still have an about. The following features are available right now. What? 
Why? <laughs> Why? I love how you can still download it, even though the servers are down. The servers went down on Christmas Eve. Forever. That's basically what they said in the end, end of service announcement. And when they released this announcement on November 21st, they said you can't buy any shit anymore. Honestly, I don't know why these people fucking spent money on this trash, trash, trash game. I have a streamer friend who I suggested it to. He has a $7,000 computer. And he literally couldn't launch it. He has better specs than me, and probably you, and he couldn't launch it. I mean, at least DayZ launches. <laughs> at least it launches. That's a basically, that's basically it, but at least it launches. Okay? Honestly. Jesus Christ. I mean, this game is worse than DayZ. It's hard to believe, but it's worse than DayZ. I, okay, so I wonder why, every, like, so, in these comments, everyone's like, No, please don't, I spent so much money on this game, no. And they're all fucking 12-year-olds with shitty mother laptops, okay? I wonder if anyone's actually like, thank fucking God. Ah, here we go, we found one. Lol, you people are all the ones who buy into shitty free-to-play games. Thank you, fine sir. Please leave the game still open. I have a thousand euros. Oh my god, you're a loser. What a fucking loser. Oh, what a fucking loser. Honestly. I just bought premium. I just bought premium. I just spent a little bit of money. Ooh, free to play. Fucks! Why would you spend a thousand dollars on this game? Why the fuck would you do it? It's horrible. I'm glad it's gone. Let's do it together, okay? Let's do it together. If you have this game, open up Steam. Okay, I'll give you a moment. Pause the video. Okay, open up Steam. If you still have it on your computer. Ready? Are you ready? The servers are down, okay? Last played 5-17-2016. Okay? Um, are you ready? <laughs> are you ready? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, I just clicked it. Oh, oh it's gone, guys. It's gone. Oh, yeah. I feel cleansed. I feel cleansed. Honestly. Uh, if you like, if you like DayZ, that's cool. I haven't played it in multiple months. And then usually when I do, I just run around and rage about how shitty it is to everyone I used to be uh whitelisted on a roleplay server for day z oh look at that bohemia interactive bundle yeah and arma 3 arma 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 day z arma 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 <laughs> that's fucking pathetic arma everything oh my god guys did they release an up two updates in under two weeks <gasps> oh my god no way best hybrid mmo you mean hybrid between shit and good you bet rising star the only thing that's keeping this game alive is youtubers who have built their back off of it yeah, I don't know what this is, but that's not DayZ. That's not DayZ either. You know what DayZ if you clicked on this fucking video. You know what it is, and you know how what it's like. But literally the only thing keeping this game from becoming Aftermath is the YouTubers that have built their back off it. Can't thwart their efforts away from the game, even though they fucking hate it. They can't move away from it. Why early access? This is the fucking games. These are the kinds of games that I rant about to, with my friends as a joke. Early access, it was playable four years ago. 
four years ago a few weeks ago. Okay? Okay? It's been four years old. That's just early access. So it's been playable for four years. Wrap that around your head, okay? Okay? Now, put this in your head. It's still early access. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. No, no. So it takes four years to develop a game. That's fan-fucking-tastic. Example, Skyrim. Boom. Done. Okay? Skyrim. All right? That took four years to develop. Or less. Get that? Or less. What the fuck? Okay, what is this on? What update is it on? Because I honestly haven't played it. Is it still in the 60s? It's still in the 60s. That's for damn sure. Woo! It's still in the fucking 60s. Uh... Oh! It's still on point six one. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, that's funny as shit. Oh, that's fantastic. No, when point six zero came out, that's when I played it. On October. In October, people. Holy shit. It's been working on ten versions for a year and a half. And one version is 1% of the game. Because it's on point six one, So that's out of 1.0. So every version is 1%. It's been working on 10% of the game for a year and a half. This game will get finished, okay? When will it get finished? 2020. You know what else is going to be finished around 2020? The next Elder Scrolls. No one's going to give a flying fuck about this game when that game comes out. Not a single fucking person. You want to know why? Because that game is going to be the greatest game ever created that we've seen for decades. And it will be the greatest game for decades. Mark my fucking words. I've said it forever, and I'm still fucking saying it. It's going to be the greatest game ever. And then you have the fucking DayZ players saying, Please make it into VR. Or, please put it on PS3. <laughs> oh. Oh. Are you fucking serious? They can't even get their shit together to make a game. A real game. Do you think they're gonna waste their time on porting it to a fucking console? There's a few games that you can't play on console. Or you shouldn't play on console. Which is why they're not on console. RuneScape. As shitty as it is, had to play that card. There's no way you can play that game on a console, despite the fact that it's literally just clicking. Just clicking. Okay? You need a cursor, though. Day Z, you need a fucking cursor. It's not even about controls. It's about the agility and the maneuverability of a cursor and a mouse. That's it. That's it. You cannot play a game without that. Certain games. Okay? Gary's Mod will never be a console game. However, can you play some Gary's Mod games on a console? Realistically, yes. So, I, can't, I actually just, I didn't know this. People are hammering the developers with VR. Are you fucking serious? I have VR on my phone. I've tried it. I almost threw up. It's still fun. But why the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, people. This game is on its way to Aftermath's course, okay? If it doesn't pick up its shit. I don't even know why I'm saying that. Because it never will. Oh, it's so shit, honestly. If you play it and you enjoy playing it, that's cool. 
But the only people keeping it alive is the developers, or not the developers, the YouTubers. Okay, that's it. That's all it's doing. I hope you enjoyed a, a, a an explicit, or a, a exclusive view into my Steam library. Ooh, it's the Steam library. Ooh. Okay, so if you like this video, please subscribe. Okay. It's a good rant. You're right. Daisy is shit. Aftermath was shit. We can now use past tense because it's a dead game now. And I'll see you guys next time.